Hello Brick Filmers! Today I will be teaching you how to use a free software called GIMP to make the background of a logo or photo transparent so that you can use it to overlay on your videos. First, download GIMP from their website if you haven't already done so, and then open GIMP. Click File, Open, and then choose the photo or logo that you want to edit. Click Open. As you can see, this image has a white background, which will not work as a video overlay. You want the image to be transparent around and in your logo. To do this, go to Layer, Transparency, Add Alpha Channel. By doing this, you're making a transparent layer behind your logo so that when you delete certain parts, you will have just transparency behind it. Next, select either the Fuzzy Select tool, which will select all of a certain color, or the Free Select tool, which is useful for selecting around uneven edges, for example, a person's body. Using one of these tools, select everything you will want to keep in your logo overlay. In this example, I'll be using the Fuzzy Select tool. By holding Shift, you can select multiple areas at the same time. In this example, I'm using the Free Select tool. If you're using the Free Select tool, you need to make sure that you connect the ends of the selection so that the line is a dashed moving line. By holding Command, you can cut out certain parts of your selection. So here I am cutting out these two areas under the arm that I don't want selected. Now that you have your image selected, go to Select Invert. This will select everything except your image. Then click Control X or Command X. This will remove everything you don't want to keep. Go to File, Export As, and then export your file. Make sure it is a PNG, because PNG will preserve the transparency layer behind your picture. Now you are ready to overlay this onto your videos. That's all for this tutorial. Thanks to John D. Mercurio for suggesting this tutorial. If you would like a certain tutorial, please leave suggestions for future videos in the comments. Thanks for watching and make sure to check out my most recent brick film on the channel and stay tuned for many more to come.